we're on. Okay. This is Storm. By D Are you trying to photograph it too? I'm filming. Okay. Storm by D.A. Levy. His signature on the painting is very faint down here. D.A. Levy. And these marks, these red marks here, he had a red guitar. Mm. And this used to hang in the apartment that Joni and I had. Joni was his cousin. And he tried to, he was upset about something. So he just swung by the neck of the guitar. And that's what these, it was a red guitar. Not a green guitar, right? Mm. And on the back, it also has his signature, August 63. And I'll read this, because this may not photograph. This painting was brutally assaulted October 4th, 1963 by D.A. Levy and in a semi-mutilated condition presented to Kent Taylor because of its absurdity. So he reframed the damaged painting, and this is slightly smaller than the original. I don't know, maybe a couple inches either way. Can I see that one other note? Sure. What is the history? Oh, let's see. Yeah, I can, uh, yeah. Uh, Levy executed Storm in August 63. It was somewhat larger than what remains. While living with Joni and me on Carnegie Avenue in Cleveland, he took baseball-like sw like swings at the painting with his red guitar. The indentations remain today. Knowing my admiration for Storm, he restored it, reframed what was left after his rampage, inscribed and presented Storm partially as restitution for the damage done to the wall behind the painting. Yeah, knocked out the sheetrock oh. of the wall behind. Anyway, that's it.